Hello everyone, this is Fahad Mirza and I welcome you to my channel. Things have started to get serious in AI as now more and more companies and enterprises are looking to extract intelligence and value out of AI. It's no more a game of just generating role plays and images. It's now about getting the investment back or seeing the real value out of AI. There are two ways companies can extract value out of AI. First, when they are able to integrate their existing applications with LLMs. Secondly, when they are able to provide their own data to these LLMs. First requirement about integrating existing applications with LLM is through agents. And RAG is what provides context of company's own data to these LLMs. That is why there is more and more focus on agentic RAG. If you take a step back and just look at what is happening in the industry, it is fairly clear. Industry is moving towards agentic rag, where what is happening is that we have all of these autonomous agents, which simply means that we, whenever a user asks a natural language query, LLMs convert that natural language query into a pertinent function call through its intelligence and then that function call or function signature is converted to an API call where existing applications are called with LLM's intelligence. And then from there, company's own data through RAG pipeline is provisioned to these LLMs and that is how LLMs provide more grounded answer on the basis of company's own data. And that is why when we have combined these, we have agentic RAG. I believe Camel AI is one of the best tools out there to take advantage of these agentic rags because they are not new to the game. We already have covered Camel AI by the way on the channel. So if you go to my channel, search with Camel, you will see that I already have covered it in great detail where I have shown you how to get it installed locally with all Llama based models, all local, all free. And then we also saw and that how to build multi-ton advanced AI agents with Camel. For the purpose of this video though, I am going to show you how you can do this agentic rag with Camel. I will be using API based models in all uh, Google Colab and most of these keys, you can just get it for free because you get a lot of credits with them. I will be using Samba Nova hosted models for that and I will show you step by step how to do that. But let's have a few more words on these Camel AI so camel ai as i said you can build customizable agents which are primarily the fundamental entities of this camel architecture and you can use your own modular stuff for example you can bring in your own vector data store you can bring your own llm and the list goes on and on and on it is quite modular and you can watch my other videos to see bit to learn a bit more about camel ai so if you're looking to build a multi-agentic RAG application, I think you're going to enjoy this video. So let me take you to my Google Colab where we are going to get started and install this. So first step is to install this Camel AI plus some of the auxiliary tools. And installation is fairly simple. And by the way, I am just using this free Google Colab, which you can also go to with colab.research.google.com. And then with your free Gmail account, you can log in. As you can see, I am just going with this Camel AI. I am using this ASGI library Starlet. And then because we'll be making async calls to these LLMs, that is why I am installing Nest Async IO. Camel AI is pretty lightweight, so shouldn't take too long. Let's wait for it to get installed. And towards the end, it will ask you to restart session. So as soon as you see this green tick, just restart the session. That is all done. Okay. Now we need to set up some of the API keys. So what I'm going to do here, I'm going to use this fire crawl to scrape a website to get the data. And then we will convert it into markdown. If you don't want to do it, you can simply put in your own file, your own data here. Doesn't really matter maybe just upload a file text file or pdf or whatever and then get the data from there and you can grab your uh, api key with free credits from firecrawl.dev so it is going to ask me the key let me insert my key here i'm just going to paste the key 
and then press enter and my key is set as you can see here next up as i will be using the hosted model from samanova and i already have covered samanova service on the channel their claim of fame was that their models are quite fast which you can also check out and that is largely true too again you can i have a free key which you can which you can also get there are some limits and stuff but i think for the purpose of this this should be good so you have put in my samanova key and then i have also set it out so we have set our key let's use firecrawl to crawl a website and get marked on content as external knowledge let me paste it here so all we are doing here is we are importing the firecrawl we are instantiating the firecrawl and then you can see just by providing this url we are you know getting the markdown and storing it in the knowledge and you will see that how quick that is and this is all being done by firecrawl already done the whole page and then you can st store that markdown in a local uh, file as you can see in this md file this is being stored in your local uh, google colab and now let me show you how you can build a very basic agent you know chat agent with camel which will be using this uh, data as a rag now before that of course we need to specify the model now for the model you can use this quant 2.5 coder 32 billion instruct which is from alibaba one of the you know i would say best open source model at the moment and then we are specifying some of the hyperparameters that you can see it is so easy to build a chat agent with camel that we are importing this ch chat agent from camel.agents and this is where we are instantiating it that's about it and you will see that because we don't we are not downloading any model we are just using api based so our agent is already done now one of my favorite parts where camel makes it so easy to give our own data as a knowledge to the memory of the chat agent you see we are updating the memory of our chat agent with this knowledge which we have created sort of a message which is sort of a chat template that's it so this is how there is an intelligent agent which is using the power of quen it has its own memory in in that memory we have our knowledge base so whenever some user comes in asks a question agent uses its own knowledge provides it as a context to the llm and then llm coupled with that knowledge gives back a grounded answer so that is the whole beauty around it now in order to build a very simple chatbot all you need to do is to run this the simple python while loop in that one we are just using this a chat agent that's it let me run it it is going to start asking you the questions you can say uh, what is samba nova let's wait for it there you go how quick that is so that is the beauty of samba nova it is quite quick and then you can uh, start chatting with it you can ask it is samba nova api key free let's go down there you go so it is telling you about free access usage limits and all that stuff pretty grounded answer here now if you think about it as camel is very very modular you can simply use an olama model with it so if you watch this video camel ai with olama you can replace the samanova model with olama models all free all private all local now i am just scraping the web and getting the data from there you can simply use your own local files and then use it as a knowledge base you can also store this knowledge base in some sort of vector store like quadrant and few others and i will be also covering it in future videos but the point here is that camel ai is quite modular makes it really easy to build these agentic rag so agentic rag is nothing but this which you are checking that we are autonomous pieces of software which are using llm are responding to users queries by with a context provided by the uh, creator of that chat agent that's all, all about it so that's it i will drop the link to camel ai in video description let me know what do you think if you like the content 
please consider subscribing to the channel if you are already subscribed please share it among your network as it helps a lot and that's all only marketing i do so i would highly appreciate any support thank you very much